some students, today I will tell you what is fat. Let's know about this in detail. Fat is a nutrient. It is crucial for normal body function, and without it, we cannot live. Not only does fat supply us with energy, it also makes it possible for other nutrients to do their jobs. Fats, which consist of a wide group of compounds, are usually soluble in organic solvents and insoluble in water. Chemically, fats are usually known as triesters of glycerol and fatty acids. Just as proteins and carbohydrates are made of similar components, so are fats. Most of the stored fat in our bodies and fat found in food exist in a form called triglycerides. These are made up of three individual fatty acids that are connected together by another molecule, glycerol. Also, you may often hear the terms saturated, monounsaturated, and polyunsaturated in relation to fat and wonder what they really mean. The saturation refers to the chemical bonds of the fatty acid molecules. Saturated fats tend to be a bit more solid at room temperature and are found in many animal foods, such as higher fat cuts of beef, lamb, veal, pork, and poultry, butter, cream, full fat and 2% milk, cheese, and full fat yogurt. Saturated fat in a more liquid form also occurs in coconut and palm oils. Our bodies can handle saturated fat. However, eating too much may increase inflammation throughout the body and blood cholesterol levels. High saturated fat intake is associated with other health problems, such as diabetes and some forms of cancer. How much fat should you eat? Experts say kids older than two should get about 30% of their daily calories from fat. Here's how that works. Every day you eat a certain amount of calories. For instance, some kids will eat 2,000 calories in a day. If 30% of 2,000 comes from fat, that means that 600 calories will come from fat. You can look at a food label to learn how many grams of fat are in a serving of food. When too much fat is accumulated, we become overweight or obese. Eating too much fat can make us overweight, but so can too much carbohydrate or protein. In fact, the overconsumption of fast carbohydrates is more closely linked to overweight and obesity than fat consumption.